Hey, it's around here. Welcome to a tech tutorial on System IO, where I'm going to show you how to use the classic editor in Newsletter. So you click on hover over emails, hover over this button, click on newsletters. It will take you to the newsletters. You're going to click on create. And now what I'm going to show you is how to use this visual editor, not the classic editor. So now I'm going to call this a schedule for tomorrow landing page challenge. That's the name of the thing plus FAQs. And then I'm going to click on visual editor. I'm going to click on save. Now I already have a lot of the text ready. So I'm going to grab this because it's actually a Facebook post anyway. So I'm just grab the text, to make my life easier. Copy, go back to system. Now here's the email. I'm going to click here on the email itself. Now you'll see the visual editor. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on it and it will take me to the editor itself. Once you're in the editor, you basically need to delete what's there. That's what I do at least, uh, which makes my life easier. And I basically start from scratch. So you see here, hover over this and you see the green, the trash bin button, click on it, delete, click here, hover again, go to the green, hover, delete. Now it's blank. Now I go to settings. I change the link color to orange, just so the links are of, of that color. So that's my brand. Uh, background color, I make it white. And then I leave the font size as it is. Now I'm going to drag text over here. I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to align it to the left. I'm going to click on the font. I'm going to click on Georgia or Verdana, whatever it is you want to do, basically. Then I'm going to highlight it, control A, hey, click on choose replacements, first name, click enter, enter, and then I'm going to paste in everything that I just got from Facebook. Now I'm going to now customize this a little bit just to make it like um, a bit spaced out. So you can see me do that, doing that as well. This, I want to answer a few questions. So I'm going to now do something like this, like that. And I want it spaced out basically, just because it's important for me that things are spaced out. Add this again, enter, like this, highlight it. Next question, enter. Okay, now let me grab the checklist. Now I'm gonna click here, see I highlight it. I'm gonna click on this, enter, paste in the URL, click on save, and now this is a hyperlink. With this YouTube thing, you don't really have to do anything, but just for the sake of demonstration, I will again hyperlink it and it will do that. It will actually automatically do that because it has the HTTPS. Uh, let me grab this again, the emoji. Question with the challenge starting. Answer, please do the conversion. Okay. Copy. All right. So that's that. I think that's pretty much it. Cool. Click on save. Usually, I, I mean, you, you should read it properly just to make sure. I mean, I've already kind of read it. It's good enough. So I'm just going to move on. Once I save it, click on exit. And now you just do the usual tags information. I usually do an emoji here as well. Okay, and then I'm gonna send it to my entire list. So I click on select all, and I'm going to exclude members, my DCT members. In my case, this will exclude specific members that uh, do not wish to receive these marketing, um, these types of emails or promotional emails. And click on save and send newsletter, and send now, confirm, and that's that. So that's how you send a newsletter using the visual editor, not the classic editor. So that's about it. If you have any questions, if you have any other tutorial you want to do on System IO, let me know. I'm happy to record anything for you if that's of interest. And uh, yeah, check out the rest of the playlist. And of course, join System IO if you haven't used it already. Um, I'm an affiliate. It's a great software. If you have any questions for me and you want to know a little bit more about what I do and how I help people, then feel free to leave a comment. If you got value for this video, please leave a comment. Let me know about the word value. Just leave a comment so I know. And I uh, really appreciate you watching. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll speak to you soon.
Thanks a lot for watching this tutorial. I really appreciate it. So if you have not used System or haven't tested it out, you can actually create a free account. You're missing out big time. It is a great software. And all you gotta do is go to aranbukai.com forward slash SIO. That will take you to the system page. You enter your email, you create a free account, take it to a test drive. And when you feel confident, like you're ready to go and this is a good tool, the pricing is simply 27 a month or you can also get 197 a year, which is pricing is not available on their website, but I have a special link for that if you wanna take advantage of it. It's actually 10 times cheaper than the bigger competitors and so on, and it's a really good plan. So if you wanna check it out, uh, go to rambukai.com forward slash SIO, and let me know once you had a bit of a look around. Uh, that's about it. If you have any other questions or tutorials that you'd like me to make on System.io, definitely let me know. Leave a comment below. I will do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. And uh, that's about it. Thanks. I'll speak to you soon.